I feel like each dish has been getting better for you. Yeah, this and, and I like the kimchi too because it's like a fermented. Think of it like a like a probiotic. Well, I can smell it. Smell that kimchi. I'm not, sure, I'm not sure what that smell is. <laughs> it smells something. <laughs> It is now time for us to dine here at the Main Street Buffet, downtown Las Vegas, and I have worked up an appetite for this. Oh, super hungry. I'm super excited, too. The Garden Court All You Can Eat Buffet here. It's supposed to be very good. Yeah, so from what we've heard, it's supposed to be very good. But you know what? Let's find out. You ready? I'm ready. Let's eat! What do you think, babe? I like this spot right here. I like that. It's That's like a nice table. Perfect little table, right? Yeah, I think it's real. I love the uh, brick backing there. Very nice. Exactly. Nice little brick backing. So there's no one behind us, and we can eat all day. I was thinking, what if we were to do something like like a four course meal? You know, we go up, we get like an appetizer. That's good to me. Plus a snack, then an entree, and a dessert. Plus a snack. Maybe another snack. <laughs> that sounds good to sounds me. Sounds good to you. I, I'm hungry. And we're early, so I think we got a lot of good stuff to check out. All right, keep it moving. Keep it moving, moving, moving. Oh, barbecue ribs, mashed potatoes. That's yeah. Right I'm gonna have to give that a try. A little barbecue ribs. Here we go, yeah. This Coming at you. We got the meat. So Dave, I think I found uh, your station right behind oh, you. Oh, I think so. They got some prime rib today, which is nice. Ooh. And also some Italian sausage, so I may have to try some of that. I think you're probably gonna try all of it. I <laughs> think I may. That looks good. Nice and fresh. Which is your favorite? That's this your one favorite? here, brown gravy, is that Ooh. really good? Ooh. What do you put on that? That's a turkey or maybe the prime rib? So there is no appetizers for us. We just kind of dive right into the meat section. Yeah, no. so I guess this is our appetizer. Yeah. <laughs> I went to the meat section and I tell you, the woman behind there, she gave you some very healthy portions. Did she? Oh, look at that. I mean, she, uh, yeah, this is a monster. Uh, but I'm excited. I'm starving. So, might as well jump right into the main course. Yeah, well, this is the appetizer main course, I yeah, guess you say. But about. it's the meat station. Uh, and I ended up getting some of these roasted chicken. I got the ribs. I got the prime. And of course, I had to get a little bit of mashed potato because I don't want to get too full. There's That's so smart. much to try. And I got the uh, nice gravy on there. Yeah, I went the opposite. I just went like <laughs> full bore, massive portion, massive portion. Cut of prime rib, right? The beef gravy, big cut of turkey, turkey gravy, of course, potato, and also Italian sausage, too. So. Yeah, so since we both have the prime, why don't we give that a shot? Yeah, that sounds good. But that gravy. It was a gravy that kind of got me. I wanted to try so with the gravy. That's a nice on. piece there. That sauce really kind of has a rich aroma to it as well. I so the the gravy is strong. The gravy is really kind of rich. jumped out at you. Yeah, really rich the gravy flavor. there. I think my piece might be a little on the well done or something. Ah. Let me try to dig more in the middle. A little tough. Mm -hmm. Well, I got a, I got about three pounds of it. Do you need any more? We have a load of it. So we're gonna work yeah, on right, that. Yeah. But it's got a lot of good flavor to it. Definitely more on the well done ish side. A little mm -hmm. rubbery ish for me. Yeah. yeah, a little tough. But the gravy is really nice flavor. Mmm. Right. The mashed potatoes, though. I'll try that. That has the gravy. a lot of really nice flavor. And I put mm. kind of that beef gravy on it. It's creamy. It's nice. Yeah. Yeah. Very creamy. Very, mm. very well uh, blended. Right. Ooh, well blended. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. Uh, the turkey now. I'm gonna try that, and I'll try this chicken. I'm gonna try the turkey gravy. Mmm. Turkey is actually very good. Mm. Very tender. That chicken is really. You, you can't go wrong with roasted chicken unless you really know how to make roasted chicken. But there's a lot of great flavor in that. Really tender. I like it. And I actually like the turkey more than the prime rib. The turkey's mm. good. It's not too dry. But I also have it covered completely with the turkey gravy, too. <laughs> so. well, who doesn't like good turkey gravy? Right. And I'm going to try this uh, Italian sausage here. Do you want to try a little bite? No, thank you. Yeah, I'm going to go for this beef rib. <laughs> Meh. <laughs> yeah, not so good. <laughs> um, a little meh. It's got a hit or miss on some of these. Here we go, hit the Italian sausage. Yeah, that one has a little bit of an interesting flavor to it. I don't think it's stuck in my teeth. <laughs> right. Not too bad. It's not, this is not very, really, it's not spicy at all. But, you know, it has some nice sausage flavor to it. Not bad. You seem very serious about that taste. Very focused. I've gotten so used to the, uh, kind of the spicy hot sausage as well. So now, I kind of look for that, but of course, it's not that. But it's oh, good. waiter, can we get some hot sauce up here, please? Right, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dave, quick question. Sure. Prime rib? Eh. Nah. What does that sound? That's a good, what does that mean? Is that good or bad? What do you think it is? I think it's bad. Oh, you found that right. <laughs> nah. Nah. 
How's the chicken, baby? Oh, very, very good. Excellent. Very, very good. That was a winner. So far, place we've been to the chicken's great. How about that? Ooh, the oh, uh, the turkey. The turkey's a winner here on my plate, and my Clearly. plate is like full of like it's, many but, things, right? But the turkey. The turkey's the good. Turkey's the turkey's going in the gravy. Absolutely. Let me, let me try a little bit. Try a little. Here, let get some gravy for you. See what you think. Mm. It's as good as our Thanksgiving dinner. Try the rib. <laughs> Oh my god, this is like, it's really good. Isn't that better? That's good too, yeah, the rib's good. That not bad. is... Not a lot of flavor. Not a lot of flavor in that one. Another rib, that yeah. has a great, the gravy. Gravy makes that turkey soar like a bird. Yeah, that's good. Like a butterfly, sting like a bee. All right, we better, we better <laughs> dance a little bit more because we have like, like nine more courses gonna, to go. Shake it down. 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 We got some yams. Oh. South by Southwest Station. You know I like my yams. Right? That looks amazing. Right? No, look at that. Ooh. Pineapple baked beans. That is oh okay. That's it. They got some fried chicken. That's it. If you want stuffing with your turkey, they got stuffing here. Stuffing with turkey. Grilled yeah. fish of the day. It almost looks like uh, tilapia. Yeah, Ooh, that's a soul. I'm getting some of that. Ooh. Ooh, a little mahi mahi and uh show you chicken along with some steamed rice. So we had a lot to try here. You got some nice stuff. Round two. Round two is right. I mean, well, I see we both went for the uh, fried chicken. I knew for the breast. I got the thigh. Oh, the thigh. Yeah, yeah, the thigh. yeah, thigh, of course. And then uh, the leg. A couple legs over there. A couple, couple chicken legs right yeah, over there. Yeah, do you want to jump in? We'll try a little I uh, fried chicken. First. Let's just Absolutely. jump in. Crispy fried chicken. That is crispy. Right? Cheers. Okay, let's do it, baby. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm. I like it. Mm -hmm. That's good. That skin. Nice and crispy, mm -hmm. but not overbearing. Like I find some chicken skins can be like really like hard and crispy, right. or too salty, or too something. No, they're, it's, it's actually very good. It's really nice. The chicken's very tender too. Yeah, I saw right. that too. Right? Yeah. Did you bite? Very good. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm biting away. I can tell on your face you really like that. That's good stuff. So it's like one of those moments you kind yeah. of have your eyes, you're like, it's like, Dave, what do you think of that chicken? Mm. Alright, so I wanted to try and make a sort of taco. Oh, excellent. And I didn't I like know it. what to do, so I just grabbed a little of everything, including sour cream, which I put on the Smart bottom. Smart for you, of my that's good for you, yeah. So I'm gonna throw some meat in there. I'm gonna take a bite of this. Okay, absolutely. I think you should try this with me. You wanna try one too? That sounds good. Is that, I bet it's good, right? It's good. For me, the only thing that was more in a soft taco shell. That's true. Maybe like a corn tortilla. Yeah. Like kind of soft. really kind of soaking yeah. up flavors. Because it's like these hard tortilla shells, like you'd have like taco neck. And you gotta be careful because yeah. it'll spill right on you. Like, ooze. It's like taco neck. That's good. Taco neck. That one's really good. Yeah, it's a, uh, this is a little bit of a shoyu chicken. Mm. Right? So I'm gonna give it a shot. I'm just gonna dive it. You can use my hand. Shoyu chicken. That's right. Here we go. I'll See show you some chicken. That's right. <laughs> no, you won't. You won't. <laughs> That's good. You gotta try that, babe. Nice flavor. Oh yeah. Oh, That's good. Okay. It almost has like a barbecue-y kind of mm. from the you know Southeast Asia. The bone just fell right out. Right. right? That's really good. It's good, right? A little sweetness to it. Fried chicken. Mmm. Right? Mm. right in good. Mm. Taco. Yeah. That was good. Yeah. I was impressed. And the shoyu chicken, I thought was good too. It was good. I'm really impressed. This is actually so far. a good, good kind of, round. Good round we got. This is a good, good round. round. Now, good now round. hold on. Now, I know you're not into yams. I'm not into yams. <laughs> you're, that's all yam for you. I'll go on to my other uh, little, little fried chicken. Uh, hot yam, you. <laughs> Want me to eat it? No, I'll eat it. No, you can try the beans. Mm. What do you think? Do y'all like it? Yeah, I don't like it. A little sweet, yeah. How about you try these beans? Beans are good. You sure about that? <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's very kind of uh, like, like bar can? barbecue sauce. Like barbecue sauce. Barbecue okay. sauce. Do you think? I wouldn't be able to eat too much of that. Yeah, I know. A little spiciness in the beans, though. I'm tasting that. Mm -hmm. A little effect. A little kick in that, yeah. Just like your wife. Just like my baby. <laughs> Give me a kiss. <laughs> While we are marinating for the next round, because I'm already getting stuff. That was only round two. We're marinating? Yeah. I'm just kind of like, let <laughs> just marinate my belly. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but I think we should probably talk about the price. I know we mentioned it briefly, but. Now, this is, of course, the dinner. Right now, it's Friday and Saturday, and Saturday. night. And it's uh, 4 o'clock to like what, 10 or so. I'm not sure right. exactly. But $28.99, and that's without a card. You get $2 off if you have status at the Boyd Gaming at like Main Street mm. Station with a card. But yeah, we paid $28.99. So not that, you know, not bad, it's a budget buffet. Right, it's right. 
right? Exactly. So. Downtown, you can't, yeah. you know, you're getting a lot of different options. The first two rounds were okay. Kind of partially yeah. impressed with some of those. But I do want to mention, like, what I thought was really cool to just kind of walking around. Some oh, of those yeah. chandeliers, they're actually antiques and collection items. They're from, uh, I think, the San Francisco Opera House. That's so cool. Yeah, same thing with some of the antiques. Like, you'll see those marble statues. Yeah, what if they're for sale? We could maybe pick one up for Desert Snow. <laughs> Bring in the old Echo. Only if it's a giveaway. <laughs> right. Maybe maybe one for Bingo. Maybe have a nice... little Bingo giveaway. Right. Bingo. 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 <laughs> Look at this here. A lot of assorted pizzas and garlic bread. And there's a total of eight stations, Dave. Nine oh stations, God. Dave. Nine. Oh, no. That's ten stations. Ten, ten stations. stations. <laughs> you doubled up. <laughs> oh, that's my pizza gym right there. Wow. So we got Manapua. And they have a Kalua pork with cabbage over here. And look at that delicious Hawaiian beef stew. That actually looks pretty good. I'm going to have to try that for sure. Got some clams there. Look at that corn soaked in carrots. Round oh, three, round three. Let it be, let it be. I know I wasn't going to get fish here, but I asked one of the uh, staff, I was like, how are the clams? And she's like, oh, I love Amazing. the clams. Okay. I'm like, all right, I'm going to give, give it a shot. Give it a shot. And I try some pizza. Yeah. What did you get over there? That looks yeah. amazing. I got some uh, Hawaiian beef stew, Ooh. which actually looks very rich. It's nice. Just some mixed vegetables, kind of stir fried. Mm. And then there's like this pork cabbage dish, which is pretty cool as well. It was very nice and juicy. Put it on some white rice. That looks yeah. wonderful. I think it's like maybe like kapua pork cabbage or oh, something. Oh, kapua. Forgive me. Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> kapua? Who knew? Uh? Yeah. Oh, I'm going to grab one of these forks over here. Yeah, good idea. I'm nervous. You know, yeah, I let's jump about, into the clams. Let's try the clams. I never thought about having clams at a buffet before. Yeah, well, that's why you have water to chase it. <laughs> it's not good. It's not good. Where's the liquor? Yeah. Yeah, where's the letter? Are you ready, baby? All right. Guess I gotta give it a try, huh? Here we go. Taking your word for it. Oh, that's good. Oh my. Not bad. That's not bad. Maybe a bit rubbery, but not too a bad. A bit rubbery. Yeah. yeah. But not bad. The flavor not is terrible. pretty good. Yeah. It's almost like a garlic butter sauce. Yeah. But still, butter. But still taste of the ocean. Yeah, you did get that. A little bit of ocean little, little gristly. Right. Give me a kiss. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Shoot. Yeah, um, I'll work those. are looking those. good for you. <laughs> for you. Where's that chaser? I'm going to have a little chaser. Where's that this, chaser? I'm going to have a little chaser of this uh, little vegetable here. Stir fried mm. vegetable. I'm going to have a little stir fried vegetable. You know what? That bite was a little bit too more oceany for me. So I have some of this squash. <laughs> <laughs> those vegetables are really good. Right? Those are really nice. I mean, I do like them when they're a little bit of a crunch to them. Right. They're not like super sogged up. Like they just kind of... These aren't too bad, right? No, they actually just came out. That's why I grabbed them. They just came out. It's like the yellow and green squash. Yeah. yeah try mm -hmm. this one. I like it. Mm -hmm. I think you gotta try some of this. Oh, you gotta try the pizza first. You gotta try the pizza. Coming at you. Now that looks like it would have been one of my favorite. It looks a little. What's, what's that? Oh no, what this is a nail. A nail. Mm. I added some crushed red pepper flakes on there. Mm. Red pepper flakes. Mm. Not bad. A little doughy. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Well, listen, it's a, you know, it's a buffet pizza. Pretty good. Yeah. I like definitely like the cheese on it, though. Yeah. I mean, I like the flavor of the cheese. Yeah, it definitely has a little bit of that doughy vibe to it. Want to try some of this Hawaiian beef stew? I don't mind if I do. That looks... There you go. Spoon Please. for you. Oh, thank you. We go dive on in here. It's like Chef Boyardee. <laughs> don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I hope not. No, no, no. Right, I'm teasing. I'm teasing. That's good. That is good. I don't taste the Hawaiian side of it, the pineapple no. part, but you'll probably like that. Straight up like beef stew. It tastes like just a really rich beef stew. Mm -hmm. Beef super tender, mm -hmm. very flavorful, like carrots in there too. It's good. Yeah. I think that is a very, very hearty. good hearty stew. Comfort food. Yes. That's comfort that food right there. That feels like yeah. comfort Want some more? a little black bowl. Pork and cabbage. Pork and cabbage, that's right. Pork, pork cabbage and rice. Let's dive into that. Give it a try. That's good. Oh, wow. That's very good. Oh my. Oh, that's really good. It almost has a like a barbecue yeah. grill, grill type. It's good. Yeah, the flavor's amazing. It's like a long term, like a long smoky yeah. vibe. Really smoky flavor. Really good flavor. flavor. I the like that. That is nice. That is really good. Not what I expected. I know. It's actually a, that's a very nice dish. That would be my favorite of this round. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Good. That is. Now I'm just gonna know how to say the right name. Oh, check out those pot stickers right there. Those look really great. Of course, they have the chow mein. The stir fried vegetables look really nice. And of course, the orange chicken. Definitely one of my favorites. I haven't had it here yet, so I'm dying to see what that one's like. The fried rice, Dave. Hey, it just opened up. That's our strategy, right? Come with the opening. Things look really fresh right now. I could not resist. So when I right. went over to kind of check out the name, Kalawa, Kalua? Should be. It's Kalua. It's Kalua. Kalua. So I end up getting kimchi. The lo mein looks really great. It does I had nice. to try like the kind of the orange the, chicken there. The orange chicken and the fried rice. And what did you <laughs> I said I, I sometimes I just gotta say what the heck. 
<laughs> go for it, babe. Two little lonely slices of pizza. And I've got a pizza battle. A little pizza, oh. Pepperoni versus sausage. Okay. Which one wins? I'll let you know. Back off. <laughs> my pizza. Okay, darn it. <laughs> no, okay. You know what's yeah, fine? Lo mein. Lo, lo mein. Yeah, lo mein looks good. I was like eyeing that before. Mmm. Mmm. That is good. It's not bad. It tastes like lo mein. Lo mein. Very crispy. Not bad. It's very crispy, yeah. I actually thought it was going to be much sweeter. Mm -hmm. mm. Not too bad. A lot of skin, but good flavor. Now, I've been impressed. Is not your flavor, not your jam. Though. Yeah, I've been impressed with the uh, kind of the Asian section they have over there, the wine section. So all in all, I feel like each dish is getting better for you. Yeah, and, and I like the kimchi too because it's like a fermented. Think of it like a like a probiotic. Well, I can smell it. Smell that. Kimchi. I'm, not sure, I'm not sure what that smell is. <laughs> <laughs> I smell something. <laughs> you know what that smell is? Kimchi. <laughs> mm. I know everyone wants to know what slice is better, pepperoni or the sausage. Pepperoni first, here we go. I'm gonna put some kimchi on it. I got my pizza. Not a strong like pepperoni flavor in that. Really cheesy, really cheesy. I'm gonna try the sausage now. Want some kimchi on that one? <laughs> you can blow that up, because I'm done. But I'd have to give it the pepperoni. Oh. But not because the pepperoni is great. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit better, but I'm not a huge fan of the slices here. Mm. Save the best for last. Save it the best for last. We hope so. So I ended up getting a German chocolate cake, vanilla ice cream with like a caramel sauce and peanuts. Yeah. Yes. Bread pudding, vanilla, cheesecake. Ah, cheesecake. I like that. You copied me on that cheesecake. I did. <laughs> I did. <laughs> no, I got caught the chocolate, the chocolate cake. <laughs> I got the chocolate cupcake. I got the chocolate ice cream, and I got the little vanilla. Vanilla. You know what you're missing though? Mi glas de leche. Yes. You're missing a big old glass of milk. I know. We'll see if I can get some. Let's see if you eat some milk before yeah. we finish. Glass of milk. We'll, we'll, we'll start yeah. though. We'll start. I'm going to try the bread pudding. I'm going to start with a little chocolate and chocolate. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Nice Things start. are looking up for desserts here. Nice start. This chocolate cake is good too. Very chocolatey. Really? Very chocolatey. So I guess yeah. it's chocolate cake. It's very good. No, it's good. Oh, this bread pudding is really nice. It's very moist. The raisins, good amounts of sugar, just kind of melts in your mouth. I'm not a huge fan of bread pudding. It really depends, but it just has all the flavors of bread pudding soaked into it nicely. Good stuff. I'm gonna try this German chocolate cake. Now what makes it a German chocolate cake? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at Here we that. Go. This is oh, what we're talking about. Thank you. Thank you so much. Big yes. glass of milk. Big glass. Don't get, don't be fooled by the Pepsi Cola. There's only one problem though. After like having a big glass of milk and dessert, I'm ready for like a warm blanket and a movie. <laughs> it has a little bit more of a store-bought flavor on mm -hmm. that one. Like I've had some really great German chocolate cakes from like bakeries before, and I don't know what makes a German chocolate cake, sure. but you you might like it. Give it a shot. I think right now between those two, the bread pudding is winning for me. Now the cheesecake. The cheesecake is good. I would say the double chocolate cake is better than the old chocolate cupcake for sure. That looks really nice. The lemon cake? Yeah. What do you think of cheesecake? It's okay. <laughs> Not great, but we've been spoiled too. We've had some unbelievable cheesecake. Ooh. Pretty good. That is really zesty. You know what, ah, try lemon, lemon cake? zest. Try it? The lemon zest is good. Yeah, you might like Romeo it. Romeo Loop. No, it's not not like that, but you do have like a little zest of mm -hmm. lemon cake, mm -hmm. but not over not overbearing. It's actually a good palate cleanser. It's like that Bellagio Caesar salad. <laughs> palate cleanser. <laughs> that is pretty darn good. That's good. Very zesty. I do. Very zesty. Tastes fresh. Yeah. Fresh. Soft. I have more of this double chocolate cake. <laughs> My favorite so far. A lot of desserts going on here. We do. We have a lot. Oh. Look at these ice creams staring at us. We have so much sugar. We're gonna be like run laps downtown, no problem. Do the towers of fire. Before it gets too more like a milkshake, I wanna try my ice cream. Try the vanilla here. Very Peanut. yellowy. Very yellowy. Might be, might be a French vanilla. <laughs> yellowy. <laughs> yeah, it tastes like more like a, a frozen yogurt type. Right? I mean, you definitely uh, taste those uh, little caramel and the nuts in there. What, do you like it? It reminds me of like a McDonald's Sunday almost. Yeah, it's kind of like ice. ice. A little, little ice. A little ice milky, yeah, a little bit. Ice milk, that's what I've been missing. Kind of ice milky. I'm gonna try to throw some little cake in there. What do you think about the dessert overall? Okay, that's yeah. bad, right? I think I like the yeah. dessert. Now, I was a little nervous at first because the last time I got those type of desserts was kind of at what, Circus Circus. Right, and that's true. was made me a little nervous. This dessert's kind of revived itself. I think the winner of all this right now, interestingly enough, was the bread pudding. Yeah. That was really good. It was warm. It was kind of like comforting. A lot of good flavors in that dessert. What about you? That's good. Well, I gotta go with the double chocolate cake. <laughs> it's not even here anymore. <laughs> Where'd it go? All in all, pretty good though. Hey, we got the nice glass of milk too. Yeah. Cheers to that. Cheers to that. I am stuffed. Oh, I am so stuffed. 
Well, oh my god. As per usual, let me ask you. Sure. Well, what'd you think of this place? Well, what do you think? <laughs> Overall, I'm gonna have to, you know, say it was a decent experience. For what you pay for the price in downtown here, the food was not bad. Some obviously hit or misses, but not bad. Yeah, no, I agree. Good value overall. Absolutely hit or misses, but 29 bucks for you know, a pretty decent meal downtown. Not bad. Not bad at all. Hey, just want to remind you guys, we are on the road to 100,000 subscribers. Literally this close. If you have not done so, take a second, please go ahead, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you get a every time we post something new and exciting. As always, thanks for joining us, Royal Fam, and we look forward to seeing y'all in Las Vegas! Vegas! Maybe at Main Street. Boop, boop.